Hey guys, I am back again with a little K-pop journal with me. As you can see from the title, I'm going to be journaling about BTS's Life Goes On. I don't think I'm going to talk very much. I'm just going to briefly talk about how I feel about the song and all of that. My voice is just recovering because I am sick. I'm all good now, but I'm just slowly getting better. So I'm just going to be using some of these pictures that I printed. It's currently raining, which is therapeutic and also very calming I have the window open and everything because it is really hot in my room and I need air so yeah if you hear the rain or outside noises like cars and birds please ignore that that's just the reality so I'm not really gonna talk about like the entire album but I must say like it's a good album it's just not my favorite my favorite albums from BTS is their dark and wild album school love affair and also love yourself tear that album is so good but yeah I like the album this album but the songs just don't hit as hard as their other albums in my personal opinion i always have to make a little disclaimer because i don't want anyone really attacking me for an opinion that i have not to say that i'm generalizing all of armies because i'm pretty sure like not all armies are the same just like not all n citizens are the same or any other k-pop fan we are not the same but i just need to put it out there that i'm by no means dissing bts if i have a different opinion from yours it's just how i feel bts has been a group that i have been following and i have loved and been a fan of since debut and i am really proud of all their achievements and accomplishments over the years that they've been a group and i am by no means saying or disregarding any of their efforts because they deserve everything that they've gotten you know i just always have to make a disclaimer because there's just some fans and i know like everyone knows this like there's fans who are just a bit too crazy and like too over the top when it comes to standing their favorite groups and stuff and like i'm not saying loving your favorite group is you know crazy but when it gets to the point when you're dissing other groups or other fans for not having the same opinion as you that's when it can get a bit problematic because if you can like this group why can't you appreciate that other people like other groups so yeah that's just a little tangent that i went on and i just wanted to bring that up because yeah, I always feel the need to make a disclaimer when I talk about BTS or say something about BTS and I'm just scared because a lot of people get offended and I know for myself that my words are not coming from a place of hatred for these guys. BTS is an amazing group and I'm not taking that away from them. So yeah, this album was good but yeah, um, I just wanted to make a spread for this song in particular because this song in particular really just has a special place in my heart this song is just so good all in all this song just reminds me of their older type of music and i'm just a very nostalgic person and this song gives me a lot of nostalgic feelings it is all about well i'm pretty sure it's about life and how life works and how life just goes on regardless if it's good or bad whatever happens life just goes on and we all have to move forward from it and grow from it and i think at a time like this i really enjoyed this song because you know as scary as life can be right now we all just have to have hope that everything's gonna be okay and then we just have to move forward everything will be okay eventually but we just need to be positive and stay strong through all of it bts really has a way of making great songs that people can you know enjoy and like find a deeper connection to it and i think they really did it well with this song in particular because BTS has always been known as the group who makes their own music and makes songs about deep and meaningful stuff. Like, that's amazing to me and should never be disregarded and should always be appreciated for their efforts in communicating a message to their fans and people all over the world. And I think they really did it well with this song. I do have to say though, like... <laughs> Sometimes it can get a bit overboard when people compare BTS with other groups because some people's main instinct is to compare people or compare groups and say like, oh, your groups don't even write their music or your, your groups don't write anything, you know, meaningful or anything like that. But it's just like, it's beyond people's control sometimes. It's beyond the group's controls and maybe like groups want to have the ability to make their own music. I'm pretty sure there's a lot of like artists out 
there in groups who would love to, you know, make music and spread a certain message to their audience. But at the same time, there's people who are, whose literal jobs is to make songs. There's people who do not have the ability to maybe communicate or sing the songs that they want to showcase to the world. So they get idols, groups, or any artists out there to sing that song for them. That's why there's composers, producers, songwriters, all of that. So yeah, that's just something I wanted to put out there as unnecessary it might have been. I just wanted to say it that you know it's okay if groups don't write their own song or write their own lyrics or you know make their own lyrics or song there are people out there who compose music and that's their dream but they cannot communicate it because they're you know maybe they can't sing or rap or anything like that but they want to showcase it to the world so that's why they give it to artists and idols it is a talent though that yeah bts are able to have such a good good presence when it comes to their songwriting and their comebacks and albums and just songs in general but it doesn't disregard everyone else's talents out there in the k-pop world or just in the music industry as a whole yeah this song just really resonates with me it reminds me of the times when life was all good and life was all fun and games and it also just reminds me of the times when it wasn't nice like when life really through all the bad things towards my direction or like I wasn't strong enough to get through it. it eases me in a way it comforts me it just has the vibe of like a song that you play when you're driving during golden hour maybe driving down the road after a good day at the beach and like the sun is just setting a really relaxing song to listen to i think it was very refreshing to listen to this song especially after like listening to other typical poppy songs that bts has released prior and just typical poppy songs that have been coming out as of lately it's just a good calming song to listen to i don't have much to say about the music video though um it's wholesome and cute because they're all together and yeah it's like it's a good music video it doesn't have a storyline it's just all of them together but yeah i just hope that i can do this spread and make it nice and everything i'm not sure if i can but we'll make it work i guess Okay, I think I'm just going to experiment with this spread now. There really isn't much that I wanted to say and I don't want to strain my, my voice too much. So I'm just going to continue journaling here. Let me know what you guys think of this song. Did you like it? How did you feel about it? And I hope you guys don't mind the little tangents that I went on as I was journaling. I just wanted to put my two cents into it. I hope I don't offend anyone or didn't say anything that can make anyone upset because that's not my intention. I really am not trying to spread hate. I just wanted to simply put my two cents into the situation. So yeah. I hope you guys enjoy the rest of this video. I'll just talk to you guys at the end when I'm done. If you need to learn how to talk to a lady, ask your mom.
so that is pretty much it for this journal with me this is the spread that i completed i feel like on camera you can't really see it but here i added the lyrics from the song and i just added a bunch of stickers just to fill up the spread and i really like how it turned out with the green and the purple green and purple just go so well together and it just looks really good so I really like how this turned out. I hope you guys enjoyed this little K-pop journal with me. Let me know what you guys think about BTS's Life Goes On and just anything you want to share. Feel free to comment down below and I will make sure to read it. I always read my comments. So yeah, thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a good day. Please take care of yourselves and I'll just see you later. Bye-bye!